Hi, I'm Bob from Plastic Pipe Shop and in this video we're going to have a look at double union ball valves and their advantages over other valves. So a double union ball valve has, as I say, two unions on it. So this is the union end here which enables the valve to be unscrewed from the pipeline and then taken out of the pipeline and serviced or checked to see if it's blocked or not and then easily put back in the pipeline and then the unions can get screwed back on. The main advantage of a double union ball valve is it's got a full bore flow all the way through. So there's a full bore flowing all the way through with nothing to catch any debris or any parts um, which might be coming down in the water or the fluid. So um, they're very unlikely to get blocked at all. So when you're putting your valve back in the pipeline, just screw the two unions on and then the system can be ready to go really quickly. An alternative to a double union ball valve which still has the same benefits of a full bore flow is a single union ball valve. However, you see the difference, a single union ball valve only has a union on one side of it. So a single union ball valve shouldn't really be used in the middle of a pipe system. It should only really be used at the end of a pipeline where perhaps water is going out into a tank or something like that. If it was used in the middle of a pipe system and you had a problem with the valve or you thought you had a problem with the valve, the only way to get that valve out is to cut the pipe on one side and then unscrew this union. And then you're left with having to glue a fitting onto the pipe so your system's going to be down for a lot longer. And that's why people use double union ball valves in, in a system and single union ball valves at the end of a system. Ball valves, although they're great with having the full flow all the way through, aren't very easy to control. There's only a quarter turn on the valve between fully open and fully closed. It's very hard to get a fine control of flow. They're great if you want a full open flow or a fully closed flow or maybe somewhere around a half flow. If you really want fine control of flow, you're much better using a gate valve like these, which have maybe eight turns between fully open and fully closed. So you can get real fine control on the valve and real fine control of flow. There's another video we've made about those fine control valves, so if you click the I button on this video, it'll take you straight to that video. All our ball valves are pressure tested to 10 bar pressure. Um, they're all wet tested at the factory before they come to us. So you may find sometimes when you take the unions off that there's a tiny bit of water or fluid in and around the valve and that doesn't mean it's been used on someone else's system. It means it's been, it's been wet tested at the factory. That's your double union board valves. Thanks for watching. Bye.